What's up everybody? So I've been getting a lot of questions from guys lately asking me, hey Lloyd, I just got out of a divorce. How do I get myself back in the game? Hey Lloyd, it's been a while. I haven't been with a girl for a while. It's because of COVID and the lockdown situation. How do I get myself back in the game? So in this video, what I'm gonna be talking about is basically that, how to get yourself back in the game. Whatever is happening with you, uh, whatever is going on with you, I'm gonna tell you how to get back into the dating world and be successful because when you're coming out of it, <laughs> it can be quite challenging. So uh, the first thing that I'm gonna talk about are some of the general challenges that guys usually have when they're trying to get back into the dating scene or they're single or, or whatever the reason is. Um, and then the second thing that I'm gonna talk about are what are things that you should start doing right now. Um, they're gonna get you right back in there. Okay, so uh, let's talk about the main problems. I would say the main problems is that when you've maybe been in a relationship for a while and, and you just got out of it, or maybe it's just been a while for you since you've uh, been with a woman, um, or maybe you've never, <laughs> Maybe you've never uh, been successful with a woman. Uh, the point is right now you're not in a great spot. You feel mentally to start dating and that's okay. You know, this happens all the time to men. You know, there's some times where you walk out and you feel really good about yourself, super confident. You know, usually maybe you've had some past successes with, with women. Maybe you have a girlfriend that you got and sometimes you walk out and you just got that swagger about yourself, you know, and women can tell, they can pick up on your confidence. And so, you know, you smile at a girl, she smiles back. You know, you feel like you walk into a room and the people's heads turn. You feel like you're in a conversation. All, all these women are interested in you. Things are going great. Now there are other times where things are not going great. Probably in this moment where you guys are, if you clicked on this video where you feel like you're not getting good reactions from people. I mean, like <laughs> before you would be able to smile at a pretty girl and now you'll smile at kind of like the chubby girl behind the checkout counter and she'll look at you like, ugh, and you're like, ugh, can't even get her to smile at me. Oh my God, <laughs> what's going on? So you feel like you need some help to get yourself back into the dating world. You're not confident, you're not feeling good. Uh, this happens all the time, okay? The worst thing that you can do when you're sucking is to try not to suck. You know, Patrice O'Neill has a really good saying about this, and when it comes to stand-up, if you're bombing on stage, is the worst thing that you can do when you're bombing is to try to not bomb. You have to embrace it. What do I mean by this? I mean, accept the fact that you're not as confident as you used to be. Accept the fact that you don't have the mindset that you had maybe months ago or whatever, maybe even last week, who knows? Accept that fact, you're in the state that you are now, and that's okay. I went out last weekend, and I was out uh, on the beach, and I was you know, doing approaches, talking to women. I've never done this for a while. I haven't done it for like at least six months, maybe even longer than that, okay? Lockdown, everything. When I first went out, I was nervous, dude, and like, this is my job. <laughs> my job is to be able to go out and do this and I can't freaking do it. I'm nervous. So the last thing that I can do or should be doing in this moment is pretend like I'm not nervous, pretend like I'm not sucking. What did I do instead? I was like, okay, I'm nervous. I'm not where I used to be. That's okay. What can I do now to get myself on the pathway to do that. What's a small thing that I can do right now? Well, a small thing that I can do right now is just pick my head up, smile, say hi to people. And that's what I did. I said hi to like 50 people. And maybe like 20 of them said hi back to me, 25 of them said hi back to me. And uh, then of those 25, maybe like 12 um, actually smiled and like actually looked at me and said and waved. Now after that moment, I didn't get down on myself and was like, oh, I suck. Like, you know, I, I'm, a, I'm a dating coach and like I couldn't even get a girl's phone number. Like, no, I didn't, I wasn't down on myself for that. Like there were some girls that I talked to that just didn't want to talk to me and, and that's okay. So instead I focused on the positives. I said, hey, 12 people smiled and waved at me. So I focused on the positive things right there and I focused on what I can do moving forward. Hey, maybe one of those 12 people would have been willing to talk to me. Maybe one of those 12, uh, it was like about maybe like, I, I was saying hi to guys too, so maybe like six of those, six of those girls would have been down to talk to me. Okay, that's a win, that's an opportunity there. All right, so the next day when I went out, I ended up doing this, I started out with the same thing, but then I took the conversations farther and the end result was me getting like a dozen numbers and then I went on an instant date with a gorgeous, awesome woman. 
okay? And then I did even better the next day on Sunday. So I didn't start out trying to make myself into the guy that I was before. I started with baby steps. I accepted the fact that I wasn't where I was and that's okay. So I started with these small goals and then worked my way up. If you're in this moment where you're trying to get yourself back in the game, the last thing that you wanna think about is being that cool, awesome guy because you're not there right now. So accept who you are, start with small goals, build up wins, and then if you focus on the positive, you will see yourself in a better light. Like you're gonna gain a lot of confidence. You're gonna build up some social momentum and that will carry you into having good interactions with women and you're not worrying about, oh, am I failing right now? Am I, am I fucking up? Like you're just gonna be focused on the interaction. You're gonna be giving her the attention she deserves and you're gonna have a good interaction and I guarantee you that, uh, that you're gonna get right back into the dating game doing that sort of stuff. So yeah, this is what I talk a lot about. Um, and this is something that I'm gonna be talking a lot about uh, in my uh, approaching system that I'm gonna be coming out with. So uh, the example that I just gave you guys previously where I went out to the beach, that was actually all recorded. Um, all of it's recorded, all of this is gonna be in the approaching system. So if you wanna get notified about that, there is a link in the description box below. Click on the link and you'll get notified. It should be coming out within the next month or something like that. So if you want to get access to the lowest prices for it, I highly recommend you join that mailing list. Thanks a lot, you guys. Good luck out there.